Hello everybody, how are you guys doing? Welcome to another Game of Thrones reaction. Ah. Guys, what happened to Shireen in the previous episode is still running vividly through my memory. I don't think, as I said, any death will ever impact me in the show as much as that death did. I'm strapped in again, by the way. You guys thought it would be necessary. Uh, I thought I was covered after I, I strapped myself in the 8th episode and nothing really happened that had me really jumping out my screen. And then episode 9, horrible, horrible, horrible fate to just the best, the purest rather character on the show. The character that least deserved this type of death, in my opinion. I don't know, unless Tyrion or Daenerys die or like both of them together, this might be the only thing that might impact me close to how I felt about Shireen's death. Knocking on, on wood that that never happens. What the fuck? Why did I even put that into the universe? What's wrong with me? Because, listen, th this is how I feel about this right now. It's like, there is nothing for me to latch onto in this show. It, it becomes increasingly more difficult for me to find things to latch onto this show. I was starting to warm up to a little bit. I was like, you know what? Out of the people that is left in Westeros, I'm going for Stannis. Big time. And then the last episode happened and I just I just can't, can't be bothered to root for Stannis any longer, obviously. I can't be bothered to, to root for the Boltons. They all suck. And it's like, what do I root for? I guess I root for Tommen. But like, he's not willing to become anything other than Cersei's son. So like, what are we doing here? I can't root for the religious cult. It's like the only salvaging thing that can happen in Westeros right now is the Nice comes in, right? That's the only thing. Boy, this sucks. This sucks. But okay, it's a new day, it's a new episode. Who knows? Something good might happen this 10th episode. It might give us something that we can be happy about. I don't know what that could be. As always, make sure you give this video a big thumbs up, subscribe for more content just like this one. And let's jump right into episode 10, guys. Come on, Game of Thrones, come on, come on, come on, give me something, give me something good, give me something good, give me something good, uplift me, uplift me, fuck you. King, his fires have melted the snows away. The, the Lord of Light did that, okay. The Lord has shown me Bolton banners burning. If it wasn't for the demon baby that this woman popped out, she'd look like the biggest con artist to me. But only because we have evidence of actual supernatural stuff going on at some point. Many deserted before dawn. Good on them. Good on them. That that would have been me. That would have been, nearly half. So that's why you killed your daughter for Stannis. That's why you did it to lose half your army. Definitely worth it, right? Yeah, you idiots. Good on the man. I would have done the exact same. Cause like, how can you go fight for this man after what you saw? Yes, it can. It can be like killing your own daughter. That could be worse than mutiny, right? Who would go to war to fight for this man? Cause what if he won? What would his role look like after he did that to his own daughter? Stannis, take note. Smart woman. Smart woman. Cause like, how do you live after that? How do you live after that? How do you live, specifically, Stannis? How do you live? How do you do it? I can understand it. Melisandre left? <laughs> Melisandre abandoned him? She quit on him? That's why you sacrificed your daughter, Stannis. For that her. woman. And now she left you. Yeah. He did all that and she left. She knows oh, he's, he's doomed. She knows it. Best Lord Commander in history to sacrifice the lives of sworn brothers to save the lives of wildlings. Which makes you the best commander in history. Just for your information. So good job on you. I'd be more used to you as a maester. I mean, I can see maester being maester in Sam's wrong. career path. But is he allowed to leave even? Hasn't he taken vows? Strategy. I mean, not that they matter that much All as we've learned things, by this point. Things that okay, then she'll die. And the baby that she named after me will die. will end up dying too, trying to protect them. But the last thing I'll see in this world will be the look in her eyes when I fail them. Mmm, a man's worst I'm fear. See a thousand white walkers and see that. Exactly. Just gonna leave him. Thank you. Best, Best commander at Castle Black like ever. Do. Oh, they'll bloody try. He's been beaten after death. How did you? Very carefully. <laughs> he wasn't moving a muscle, so let me tell you. <laughs> but hey. To your return. My return. 
I don't like these goodbyes by characters in the show. I hate these goodbyes by characters in the show. Clearly nothing happened to Sam. Contrast this image to how we got introduced to Winterfell is crazy. Okay, Sansa, are you trying to escape? I mean, you're pretty obvious right now. You're not doing a great job of hiding yourself. This guy already recognizes who you are. Oh wait, Sansa is trying to open... Sansa is gonna try and light the fire for Brienne. And Brienne is gonna be like, I have to go kill Stannis now. At least kill him, Brienne. At least do that. <laughs> Just... If you waited 10 more seconds Let's though. Party immediately. Siege begins at sunrise. It's not going to be a siege, your grace. They're meeting them at open field. They were ready. They were ready. Yes, yeah, Stannis, you're fucked. So, I, I thought he was a great bad planner. Sansa, take advantage of this opportunity maybe and leave. That was it? <laughs> Who is it? Ramsey or Ruiz Bolton? Bolton has women fighting for him. Oh, it's Brienne. Okay. I don't fight for the Boltons. I'm Are you gonna kill him? This King's guard to Renly Baratheon was there when he was murdered by a shadow with your face. You murdered him? With blood magic? I did. In the name of Renly of House Baratheon, first of his name, rightful king of the Andals and the first men of the realm, I, Brienne of Tarth, sentence you to die. Do you have any last words? Go on, do your duty. So that's it, five seasons of story building for Stannis' arc and he just gets completely slaughtered. That's it, that's what he did it all for. I'm upset again now, that's what they did it all for, that's why they sacrificed Serene, that's what this was. All of this time, all of this build up for this, I mean it's realistic I guess, but like... My lady. I've come to escort you back to your chamber. We don't care about you! Die? But who said anything about dying? So, okay, we all know that wait for him to come back? Theon is gonna snap out of it. Theon is gonna snap out of it, kill her. Good riddance. Theon is back. He's coming back. Theon, run. Take her and go. Thank you, we at least get Theon back. That's something. That is something. What are you guys doing though? No. You're gonna break at least both of your legs. No, there's no boost. You don't have any bushes to aim for. You thinking what I'm thinking, partner? Aim for the bushes. So we killed one character that needed to be dead long ago. Just killed in the previous scene. Kill this motherfucker now too, come on. Enough, enough, enough. Enough. I hated the way they ended Stannis' story, I really did. I mean, that's what he would, he deserved. But, okay, that's Arya. That's definitely Arya. Yep, this is just how she trained for. Yeah. Get it over with. Or rather, yes, make him suffer. That's that's preferable. True. True. The first person on my list, you know. Yes, he was. For killing Sirio Pharrell, remember him? Probably not. Do you know who I am? The goddess of fucking death. You know who I am. I is turning into a fucking I'm badass. Stark. And I'm here for it. You're no one. You're nothing.
That is bad as hell. I'm still pissed off. That's five seasons of building up Stannis. Building up his story, rather. I didn't give a fuck about Stannis anymore, but like his story and the god of death or whatever, god, god of light or whatever. Wrong and Melisandre and all that shit. And that man's life was not yours to take. Girl stole from the many faced god. Only death can pay for life. Hell no. What are you talking about? Oh. Just like that, she loses another person that she cared about and cared for her. Why are you crying? You don't know half of it. There was no one. But if you're. What the fuck? Who's this? No one at all. Just as a girl should have been before she took a face from the hall. The faces are for no one. You are still someone. And to someone. The faces are as good as poison. Huh? No, I, I thought I understood what they were doing here. I have no idea at all, apparently. What's happening? What's happening? Huh? I'm not even gonna try and comprehend. Why are you kissing a child? Do you think mother will like him? If she sees you're happy. I'm sure she will. <laughs> She's really definitely gonna that. loathe him. Have you ever known your mother to like anyone? Aside exactly. From now that you've seen more of the world, you've learned how. She's gonna. She's really gonna tell her. People can be. She said, "You've been to Dorne. You've seen. <laughs> you've seen families you fucking each other." Trying to say what I'm trying and failing. What's your no already? No, I'm afraid you don't. She does. I do. It's been so obvious. Everybody knows. Everybody fucking knows. You and mother. I'm glad. That you're an incest child? I mean, based on other incest childs, I guess father. we've seen, he, she has turned out pretty alright. This is big for Jamie. That's why she kissed here. Poison. That's why she kissed here. I was like, that was... Too random. More innocent children dying. Well, Cersei's gonna be furious. She might even wage war against Dawn. Does he always talk so much? <laughs> That's not even a lot for Tyrion, to be honest with you. Okay, we got Mr. Warren back. <laughs> oh, he speaks Valyrian. Of course he does. As long as he promises not to kill me in my sleep. If I ever kill you, your eyes will be wide open. Why are we doing this? <laughs> Why would we bring you? Why would you not bring Tyrion? Yeah. Fight. Yes. I have fought. Are you good on a horse? Yes. Middling. So mainly you talk. And drink. I've survived so far. <laughs> she has. Some of us have experience governing a city. Except for him. Listen to him. They wouldn't. Okay, I can see that. They will Tyrion ruling Marine. I'll come with you. Not to go anywhere. I am. He is. He's the toughest man with no balls I ever met. But you still can't go. Why did he have to say? believe in you. If you leave, half this city will consume the other half. Hasn't that already and been Masande. happening? Our queen trusts no one more than Missande. Missande is going to become the queen of Marine. I can see it. Try not to ruin her. I like the trio that we have in Marine. Tyrion is gonna be like the hand of the king, just as she was in King's Landing. Miss Sunday, they're gonna have her be like the replacement for Danny as long as she's absent or whatever. And Worm is just gonna be there as well in his usual role as she was with Danny. Hello, Varys. When did you get here, my guy? There's no point asking how you found me stuck here, trying to placate a city on the brink of civil war. <laughs> You've been there before, haven't you? Information is the key. Learn which of your friends are not your friends. Sounds just like a city you knew, if doesn't only I it? Knew someone with a vast network of spies. If only. A grand old city, choking on violence, corruption, and deceit. <laughs> Who could possibly have any experience managing such a massive, ungainly beast? It did miss you. Like it was at King's Landing again. I can live with that as long as Tyrion and Danny reconnect. 
Don't have Tyrion spending all the rest of the season on Meereen and Danny somewhere else. You have to go home. Yes, ma'am, I know. Just, just let me rest a little bit. Can you take me back to Meereen? I'm in pain, mother. How far did you carry me? Okay, if you could stop the questions for a little bit and let me sleep. Mom, jeez. Drogon, we need to return. My people need me. Hey, 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 ma ma mom, mom, where are you doing? I'm, I'm, I'm cleaning myself here. That's not polite of you, mother. Get off my back, please. No. Let me chill, and then we'll go. Well, there's no food. <laughs> At the very least, you could hunt us some supper. Danny, <laughs> take care of your child, please. <laughs> You're awfully demanding from a dragon that just got stabbed a couple of times, saved you, and flew for however long he flew for. <laughs> Let him rest. Go get some food. Does Danny know how to hunt anything? Or cook anything ever? I'm, I don't think she does, right? This is gonna be funny. If it, we get to see Danny like trying to survive, quote unquote, by herself and her huge ass dragon. <laughs> It's a Kalasar. It's a fucking Kalasar of the Dothraki. What is that ring for? Does he drop it so that they'll know she was here? So that they'll find her? Not again! My god, how many of them are there? How many of them are there? I don't want Danny to go through this shit again, bro. Not again, bro. Again, I want absolution. She means literally. She needs a bath. The crone came to me about Sir Lannister. Your cousin. Other men. No. She's giving half truths. No. You didn't learn your lesson, it's Cersei. There is not one shred of truth to it. I deny it. Good. Your trial will prove your innocence. Trial? I have confessed. To a single sin. Others you have denied. I haven't seen my son. I don't know how long it's been. I need to see him, please. I will permit you to return to the Red Keep. Thank you. Am I free to go? After your atonement. What does atonement mean? Atonement. Punishment? She will kill that woman, Cersei that is. Okay, so they're giving her a new haircut. I mean, it's it, it's healthy to cut your hair once in a while, ladies. It'll grow back. It's just hair, you know? This is the new fresh cut, that's it. And they cut her. Horrible barbers. I would not be paying. See, it's not that bad. She looks like what? Annie Lennox? Isn't that the singer's name? <laughs> A sinner comes Damn, they brought the whole city out. She has committed the <laughs> they brought the whole city out. And the suburbs. And the villagers. And begged for I didn't know King's Landing had this many people. Demonstrate her repentance. They brought everybody. <laughs> they brought everybody out for this. That's the scene. No, this is just kind of perverted, Shame. to be honest with you, old man. I knew of, of the same thing, I did not know Shame. the context of it. Shame. See, he's a pervert. Shame. He was just looking at her ass right now. Shame. These aren't religious practices. Shame. I mean, she did bring this on herself, so how upset can I be at the end of the day, right? She is the one that gave them the power to do this to her. Shame. First of all, how is this making her better? <laughs> You're only gonna turn Cersei worse i promise you but shout out to lena Hede for this scene because she really had to do this shit she has to. she had to do this shit so they couldn't fake this in any way so damn i hope she got paid a hefty amount of money for this episode yeah i, did, I don't like cersei but this is not something that i ever want to see. I don't know. Shame. 
Shout out to Lena Hedder. This isn't a godly act. <laughs> See, you've only made her worse. She's already a semi deranged person. So, this, like the moment she gains any power back, she might as well start killing the entire kingdom now. Out of spite for this. Yeah, this, this was hard to watch. The fuck are you looking at, creep? It's good to have you back. Why is my cell still alive, bro? Look at this. This is you've created a monster now. That's figuratively a created monster and literally. The princess. I hate her. I hate this bitch. It's one of the wildlings you brought back. Says he knows your uncle Benjamin. Says he's still alive. Are you sure he's talking about Benjamin? Said he was first ranger. I don't trust this kid though. No, is this a trap? Okay, no. Could be Might not be. Could be. No ways to find out. Where is he? Over there. Because everybody's involved. Fuck no. <laughs> fucking no, bro. For the watch. So fucking no, bro. 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 No bro. No bro. No bro. What? Why this kid you for the watch. It's a fucking serious horrendous. It's a fucking serious horrendous. It's a fucking serious horrendous. This fucking shit is horrendous. This fucking shit is horrendous, bro. This fucking shit is horrendous, bro. This is fucking crazy, bro. This is fucking crazy. 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 Did not just kill John fucking Snow from this goddamn show. My cell is still. Alive. That's all for me guys. Thank you so much for watching. Keep an eye out for the end of the season live stream. I'll let you guys know. Probably be there around this weekend, the weekend that this video will be published. And uh, we'll talk about we'll talk about season five there. We'll talk about season five there and I'll talk also talk about this at the end at the start of the next I don't have a good one guys. Bye.